Hi everyone. I just wanted to show you how to make color changes in this tapestry crochet bag that I'm working on. I'm using half double crochet stitches and I'm working in the back loops only. And I'm following this uh, graph here that I made. Um, I'm doing a chevron striped kind of pattern here. And right now the row that I'm working on, or the round, is four white stitches, four pink stitches, four white, four pink, four white, all the way around. So here I have made four or uh, two pink half double crochet stitches in the back loops only. So I need to make two more pink and then I'll be switching to white. So I'm going to yarn over with my pink and I've been working over the yarn tail that I'm of the color that I'm not using. So right now I'm working over the, the white tail. Yarn over, insert my hook into the back loop only. And I'm gonna pull up a pink loop here. And I'm gonna yarn over again and pull through all three loops on my hook. And I'll do the same thing in the next stitch. Yarn over, pull up a loop. So now there's three loops on my hook. And this is the last pink stitch that I need to make. So I'm going to be switching to white at the end of this stitch. So I'm going to yarn over and pull through all three loops in the white yarn. And then my next four stitches will be made in white. So I'm going to yarn over, insert my hook into the back loop only of the next stitch. Pull up a loop, three white loops on my hook. Pull through all three, so I, and I'm going and I'm working over top of the pink tail here. So there's three white half double crochet stitches. So here's the last one. So again, I've worked it all the way up to the last yarn over. Now before I switch colors, I'm just gonna give the pink a little tug here to make sure it's nice and tight. So it's not showing through the stitches. I'm going to yarn over and pull through all three loops in pink, and now I've switched to pink again. And then I'm going to yarn over, I'm going to do my four half double crochet stitches in pink yarn. So there's one, two, three, and now the fourth one. I'm going to work it all the way up to the last yarn over and then I'm going to yarn over and pull through all three loops in my next color. So back in white again, pulling through all three of those loops. So just make sure you keep giving the yarn tail a tug so that you can keep it tight behind all of those stitches there because you don't want to see it sticking through. So here's that fourth half double crochet. I'm gonna pull that pink tail tight. Then I'm gonna yarn over in pink. And then four more in white. So I'm gonna pull that white tail tight here. And there we go, I'm switching back to white again. So I'll be continuing that all the way around here. And because we're keeping the tail nice and tight and behind, uh, we shouldn't see the other color showing through our stitches. You'll see it a little bit on the inside of the bag, but no one's gonna see that there. And there you go, that's how to make those color changes. I hope you enjoy this pattern.